NMI Governor Arno Palacios submitted his annual fiscal report to the legislature after his first year in office. This year, he noted that the total revenue collection is $163.8 million, resulting in a $313,000 shortfall. The end of the fiscal year saw a $4.1 million deficit. The administration also provided their year in review and outlook. Palacios noted that they began their term with painful but necessary cost containment measures like downsizing government, terminating non-essential contracts, and reducing work hours. The governor also disclosed that through his tax collection task force, they have brought 226 taxpayers into compliance, executing installment agreements and recovering approximately $8 million to date since last July. They plan to continue that work into the new year. He says the Commonwealth can look forward to more major federally funded projects made possible through the Infrastructure Investment and Jobs Act and the Inflation Reduction Act. The NMI expects more than $24 million in disaster-related reimbursements from the Federal Emergency Management Agency. He said he also hopes to sign revenue-generating bills from the legislature. Palacios told legislators, though not without challenges, the new year brings great promise for the Commonwealth. That promise becoming reality remains to be seen. Tomas Manglonia, KUAM News, Rhoda.